Hello and welcome back to ASX Options. So if you've noticed, um, we've now hit our 100 subscribers. We're pretty happy. Um, and because of the change, we wanted to allow to talk about anything we want in the financial markets. So we've actually rebanded the channel and called it ASX Portfolio. So this goes in hand with a website that you can see here. And here it's more generalized into anything on the ASX, financial markets, etc. So this will be able to give us a, a broad range of topics, not just options. Um, of course, we'll still talk about options, so don't worry for all of you who are more interested in that. Um, but yeah, yeah, exciting. We just want more flexibility in what we can discuss and, and talk about here on the channel. So getting into the website, if you haven't checked it out yet, um, you got a whole bunch of stuff. Um, the landing page follows on to the learning page where you can click on whatever topics you want and find out more information. Now, to get access to the tools um, behind the scenes, you have to sign up for an account, but it's free. Um, you just need to put in a username and a password and you're, you're away you go. So there are a number of tools, but today we're gonna to talk about the Black Shoals option pricing model that we actually coded up um, before in Python. So if you click on your portfolio tools button there, go down to options and volatility tools, pricing models. So it's a pretty neat interface here. Um, you have all your inputs that you can see, the underlying price, the strike price, the volatility, days to expiry, call, put, and the interest rate. And you can see what you can calculate here is the price and the probability of exceeding that strike. Okay, so let's let's just say we have a stock of forty dollars. We want a strike of forty-five. Let's just say volatility of thirty percent and seventy days to expiry. Now, if you saw there, you could see that as we change the days to the of expiry, right? You can get a good feel for the dispersion of that stock price over time. Obviously, the more amount of time that passes the more dispersion in the possible prices that we'll have at the end. And that's just a function of square root of time or the GBM model or however you wanna phrase it. Now, if we decrease volatility, of course, that possible outcomes then really shrinks in. Um, and yeah, you, you can play around with this tool in your own time, but it's, it's a lot of fun. Hopefully it'll lead to good results in conjunction with the ASX options website where you can go and see different chain ricks for, um, for options pricing on the ASX. So yeah, handy little tool there, gives you good um, intuition of the stock price possible movements and of course the price and the probability associated with exceeding the strike. So please enjoy the tool. Um, it took us a while to code up, so yeah, easy. Well, yeah, welcome to ASX Portfolio now and uh, join us next time.